Welcome to the reporting module. In this session, we'll introduce you to the Sage CRM reporting features. After this session, you'll be able to identify the features of the reports work area, to identify which company departments will use which report categories, and to write and run reports. Sage CRM allows you to create, analyze, and share a variety of useful reports based on customer information. You can choose a report from one of the extensive range of predefined reports, or you can create your own. Users from every department in your organization will find the Sage CRM reports facility useful. Sales representatives and managers can generate reports that help to manage all sales activities and enhance their ability to successfully pursue sales leads. Marketing personnel can generate reports to track marketing campaigns and to evaluate the effectiveness of each campaign. Customer service agents and managers can generate reports about a variety of customer services records which can then be used to improve relationships with customers. System administrators can generate reports to monitor user activity. All users benefit from the extensive range of reports that provide information about other communication activities. You can access the Reports homepage by selecting Reports on the main menu. The Reports panel displays a list of the available report categories. Each category contains a list of reports that you can define and run to generate results. My Favorite Reports contains reports that you use frequently and have selected as favorites. Campaigns contains reports that track your marketing campaigns. Customer Care contains reports for keeping track of customer care issues. Lead Reports contains reports for evaluating and tracking leads. Sales contains reports to help sales personnel to manage their sales and for sales managers to better manage the entire sales pipeline. Administration Reports contains reports for system administrators. Activity Reports contains reports for analyzing past, current, and future communication activities. Communications contains reports for tracing current communication activities. General contains reports for monitoring all the companies and people in the system, as well as your regular contacts. Marketing contains reports to track the effectiveness of marketing initiatives. Outbound Calls contains reports for monitoring outbound calls. To view the reports that you can run in each of these categories, you simply click the appropriate category in the Reports panel. Sage CRM report results are displayed in a list, a cross-tabular, or a historical format, depending on the type of report you have run. In addition, each report can be viewed on screen, generated as a file in either a printable PDF format or in a CSV format. The list report format presents rows and columns of information based on selected criteria. The Company List by Segment report, for example, generates a simple list of companies according to their industry segments. For example, let's say you want to run this report to generate a list of the computer software companies on your system. To run this report, you first select the Reports button on the main menu. Then you click on the General Report category. From the list of general reports displayed, you click on the Company List by Segment hyperlink. Notice that the Screen Radio button in the 
Display Options panel is selected by default. Now you select the criteria for the report, and then you click on the Go button. The Company List by Segment report results are displayed in a new window. The Cross-Tabular report format presents results across X and Y axes, based on the criteria you select. For example, the Activities Logged Report by User report generates results about all communications logged in the format shown. Let's say you want to run this report to generate results about all communications logged by all users over the previous month, and to create a PDF version of the results. First, you select the Activity Reports Report category. Then you click on the hypertext link of the Activities Logged Report by User report. In the Search Criteria for Report panel, you select the search criteria for the report. In the Display Options panel, you select the Print Preview radio button. Finally, you click on the Run button. The Activities Logged Report by User report results are displayed in a new window in a printable PDF format. The Historical Report format presents a static view of a record at a previous point in time. For example, the Opportunity Closing History Report generates results about different types of communications logged by specific users over a specific period of time. Let's say you wanted to run this report to generate such results for the previous month, and then save the results as a CSV file. First you select the Sales Report category. Then you click on the hypertext link of the Opportunity Closing History Report. In the Search Criteria for Report panel, you select the search criteria for the report. In the Display Options panel, you select the Export CSV Radio button. Finally, you click on the Go button. The Data Closed History for One Opportunities report results are displayed in a new window. Sage CRM allows you to create unique reports that will generate report content according to criteria you have specified. You can create reports in list, cross-tabular, or historical format. To create a report, you select the Report category to which the report's purpose is best suited. Then you click on the New button. You type the name of the report in the Name field. The Report Type drop-down list allows you to select what type of report you want to create. List is the default value. You can enter a description of the report in the Description field. Then you select the Source View, which contains the range of fields you want to include in the report. The Select Column panel is displayed. The Report Category drop-down list allows you to change the report category from which you will be able to access the new report. There are a range of additional report detail options that can be activated by checking the appropriate checkboxes. In the Select Column panel, you add columns to the Report Contents and to the report's search criteria. You can also add columns to the report's sort on and group by functions. For example, to add columns to the report contents, you press Control on your keyboard and then you click the Add to Report Contents button. You use a similar method to add columns to the search criteria sort on, and group by elements of the report. When you have finished, you click on the 
Continue button. Next, you set the default values for the report's search criteria. Then you click on the Continue button. On the Report Options page, you configure how the report results are presented. Then you select Save, and the completed report is added to the report category. Now you can identify the features of the Reports Work Area and identify which company departments will use which report categories. You can also write and run reports.